Charlton this afternoon. Charlton at home to relegation threatened Reading and it turned out to be quite a day once again for Charlton. Talk us through it, mate. Yeah, we scored just after six minutes with a, a massive kick from Sasha Illich right down the middle. Clive got a touch and, and towed it in. And Paul Mortimer bent this free kick around the wall. Um, that was about 44 minutes, so that's two good times to score. And um, he enjoyed that, as you can see. <laughs> he, he certainly did, didn't he? <laughs> and then um, probably the, the, best goal, up. the best goal of the game, <laughs> I think. Um, started and finished. No, it was, it was good play from Sean. Um, he's been playing well the last few games, showing his pace down the line. And a lovely little chip in. And, you know, I'm only a few yards out there, so... I was really pleased. The deadly number 13, you're obviously not <laughs> uh, superstitious. No, no, I've been out a couple of games with an ankle injury and just pleased to get on. Well, here's the table, and time is running out for Reading, who've now lost eight in a row away from home, 22 altogether, and they've let in more goals than anyone else. QPR start the night just two points clear of the relegation zone, but a win will lift them up four to 15. Charlton's win has taken them to within one point of Sunderland. They have played two games more and their total of 78 points is a new club record.